How you doing guys? Welcome back to Cars and Mods, man. We're about to do the third review of the day with the Ferrari 430. By the way, guys, 95% of you guys ain't subscribed to my channel, man. You guys are watching my videos but not subscribed, so please help the brother out. Subscribe to the channel, keep your notifications on, hit the bell, hit the like, comment on the section below. But we're gonna be doing a video on the new map on the third car. We did the like the Lardo, we did the BMW M3, and now we're doing the Ferrari 430. All three cars have been spec'd out to the max. To be honest, um, this this track is not meant for every type of car. I tried Group One, Group Twos, even Group Three cars, and with the new physics, you know, it just destroys those type of cars being able to drive in this track because the bumps and uh, whatnot, you know, you can't drive, you cannot drive a car really dropped on this type of track because they feel it. So the new physics makes you feel like, you know, the bumps and, and all that stuff. So I say like touring cars and regular cars are okay. Supercar, like right now we're great. I'm racing with hypercars. But I had to put my suspension up because the way it was stopped, it was not at any turn at all. I was crashing on the walls here and there. So right now this Ferrari 430, it was kind of ugly, but this is up on the suspension. And it's just this map is crazy. I like the map, but it feels so tight. The fact that it's only a minute <laughs> to make a lap, this is funny. But yeah, I like the scenery, the graphics are amazing. I played this map back in Gran Turismo 5. It's a long time ago, man. And yeah, man, I'm a veteran on this game. I've been playing Gran Turismo since Gran Turismo 1. Gran Turismo 2, when it came out with the double disc, the arcade mode, and the uh, other, the other mode that you make money and you know, build your garage and whatnot with the memory cards, 8 megabytes. <laughs> I remember that, man. 8 megabytes of memory cards. Now we got a terabyte systems. This is crazy how technology has advanced and changed, right? But yeah, this uh, Ferrari 430. It's amazing. I love the way it looks. It handles way better than other tracks down here, right? Here is just, I don't know, I don't know if it's just this track particularly, but we took it to Le Mans, we took it to you know, other tracks, and it's a beast, I love it. It's just a breaking right? Maybe because it's going downhill, but it's a beast of a car. And my other car, the Gallardo, the twin turbo Lamborghini. That thing puts a thousand and seventy-five horsepower all-wheel drive, and we put that on the mod on the eight hundred. We ran the hybrid, hybrid class. It's a five laps cash out. It's one hundred fifteen thousand in the first place. We beat that thing with no problem. Like, that thing wanted just just race and beat the road. That's how powerful it was. Whoa, 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 whoa. So, I think our next car that we're gonna try out would probably be the Rally Subaru. Or not the Rough. But yeah, guys, this is the Ferrari 430. Livery Walk style. We got the Livery Walk library on. With some nice this is one of the new ramps that we that we got that came in the update as well and yeah let me know what you guys think man hit a like subscribe to the channel guys and let's go to the next video let's see what car should we do next in the comment section below out of the six cars this is the third car we've done so we still got the rough we still got the um subaru and we still got the new i think it's the genesis uh, that we gotta do it's a million dollars but um let me know in the comment section below and we'll be doing that video soon 
Alright guys, shout out and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.